Hey y'all, you have found a video on a YouTube channel dedicated to all things WordPress and specifically this video is going to be a section of a webinar, a longer webinar that I did with Rebecca Gill in the WordPress industry. She's really looked at as one of the leaders in search engine optimization. This particular section is all about what's changed with Google's algorithm. She highlights a lot of variations that have changed over the years. If you've been trying and trying and trying to grow your SEO in the last decade, what does it look like? This is about a three, three and a half minute section from that longer one hour video. If you'd like to watch the full webinar, I'll put the link in the description box below. I'll also put it up here and I'll put it at the end of the video. Let's jump into the video right now and catch this section. Okay, so in the old days, uh, SEO seemed so easy. I, you know, I started, as Corey said, I started with SEO 15 years ago, sales and marketing 20. And we were, it was like, uh, you know, you've heard about cowboy uh, coding and that was us in the old days of SEO. I mean, we did crazy stuff and you magically, you could just get to page one and rank. But then, you know, it, it just things, things didn't quite stick that way. But, but when we were there, we could, we would, we could see page one, we could get there. We had all of these dreams and we had all of these expectations, right? And, and we were given the kind of the keys to the castle and we could do what really whatever we wanted to get to page one. And there was some crazy stuff that we did to get to page one. And it was really stinking easy back then to rank because you just had to know a few of the basics. And why was it easy? Well, desktop was the only search. People only search for one keyword. Maybe they search for two, but there was no more than that. We could rank with 300 words on a piece of content. That whole not provided in those Google reports didn't exist. And when we actually saw in a report that we were ranked number one, we were actually number one. I mean, like, and like I said, it was, it was beautiful back then. Those were definitely the good days. But then life started to change you know over the over the last really i would tell you five six years things have shifted i've run my agency for nine years and when i started with the agency seo was still pretty dang easy um but the economy wasn't but seo was and then things started to shift the technology and the algorithm that google used became much more complex Google continues to make updates. They're updating the algorithm um, daily, actually. They do make major changes, you know, a couple times a year, but they do daily tweaks, and that's kind of hard to keep up with. They started giving out penalties. That stinking knowledge graph came where it takes over the, you know, the um, page one search results. Yeah. Voice search came out, and people started to really shift the way that they're using search. Mobile indexing started. That was that just really hit, and Google's you know moving the way it indexes websites from the desktop versions over to the mobile versions. And then finally, in just the last few weeks, Google started rolling out a not secure warning in Chrome. That's a lot of changes, and it can make people really feel overwhelmed with SEO. It can make you feel like you're ch chasing that green dot in the Yoast SEO plugin, that you're not making any progress, that you don't have any control, and that your life might be stuck with pay-per-click and Facebook ads. But even with all of that and the downward sli slide that you may feel like you're in, I'm going to show you that there's a lot of upside to it. Even though we have to deal with things like lack of data and a focus on those plugins and all of those penguins and pandas and the knowledge graph and personalized search and now semantic search and malwares, I mean, there's just so much, right? But don't feel like you are spiraling down a hill and you do not have control of your destiny because I want to show you that you really do. I want you to know um, that you can have uh, success and with SEO and you really can excel with it. And I always want to remind people that they can move mountains with SEO. They can win at search and they can bring in lots of traffic and not just traffic, but really highly targeted traffic that really pertains to your website and who you want to serve. Pretty amazing, right? If you're ready now to go forward with how to actually do on-site SEO, it's time to catch the full one hour webinar. I have that video totally for free right here on YouTube for you. I'm gonna put the link right here. I'll put links in the description box below and I will see y'all next time. Bye y'all.